the type of shit you never see on the news, the stuff they don't want to talk about, what's happening now. 16 years ago, um, in the 21st of July, 2002, the Israeli Air Force dropped a one-ton bomb on the house of Salah Shkade in uh, Gaza Strip. As a result, um, about 15 people died. Most of them were children. Some of them were babies still in the womb of their mother. I think one of the children, in a way, that uh, died in this attack uh, was the naive Zionist boy that I myself used to be back then. I was still an obedient rescue helicopter pilot in the Israeli Air Force. I didn't shoot anyone myself, but I was part of an organization that today I feel uh, has more to do with the terror activity than defense. About a year later, in almost the same date now, the 23rd of uh, September 2003, together with the 27 Air Force pilots, um, we published our declaration that from now on we refuse to obey our orders and we refuse to be part of the ongoing occupation and the ongoing oppression and discrimination and killing of innocent Palestinians. Uh, that that letter uh, that I initiated and with the help of other pilots in the Air Force uh, in a way changed my life. Um, and 16 years later, um, two months ago, I was uh, leaving uh, Palermo. I guess we just supposed to keep our mouth shut and not talk about that type of stuff, huh? It's not really happening. I get it.